Um, we've been talking about for, for, I don't know, the last couple of years that there was a changing of the guards, right? And we're here. Um, and the Lord said, there's coming a new revolution, even in the music industry, particularly the gospel music industry. He says, you have polluted my sound long enough. And they, some of these gospel artists, I don't know if y'all know or not, some of these gospel artists are not saved for real, for real. And before I came on live, this is the last thing I heard the Lord says. He said, you can't take somebody to a place you've never been. Some of these artists and people singing and performing, they don't even get in the presence of God and then they try to lead us into the presence of God. The Lord says, you can't take somebody to a place you ain't never been. Um, and he said that worship is going to be put back on the front line. Worship is going to be put back in the front line. They're even going to come out with songs um, in, the, in the coming days where songs, in the songs, you offer salvation. I don't know why no artist has done this as of yet. Music is the way to connect people. Salvation should be inserted in songs. He said there's scripture coming back to songs. He says some of these people that have had a lot of influence in the gospel music industry are going to lose influence. He said it was called gospel music for a reason. And there no, hasn't been any gospel in the music. And he also said that the name of Jesus will be put back on the forefront. No more diluting for the sake of other people's beliefs. You know how we say God sometimes and we say, you know, we don't want to offend anybody. He said, no, the name of Jesus is going to be back on the forefront. It doesn't matter who's offended by it. Everybody comes out of the closet and say they believe in this and they believe in that and they doing this and they doing that. We as believers got to be bold, too. And he says, my word will never return void. There's a divine shakeup. There's a divine shakeup.